Welcome to our executive interview series at Fed Talks, presented by FedScoop. I'm Brandi Vincent with Scoop News Group, and we're here with Prashant Vadlamudi, the head of global cloud compliance at Cisco. Prashant, thanks for joining us. Thank you. I want to start by asking you, what would you say has been one of your organization's biggest achievements over the past year in terms of IT modernization? Thank you. Um, so as far as Cisco goes, uh, we are a technology company. So we also uh, develop and offer security and networking SaaS services to our customers. So we ourselves are going through an IT modernization journey, but we are also enabling our customers through these products that we offer to them to go through their own IT modernization and transformation journey. Um, over the last one year that we have increasingly focused on in our own product development phase is automation. As we are building these products, we are making sure that these products have the right automations in place wherein the basic security and compliance requirements are baked into these products, which we internally use to certify these products against various certifications such as frame, uh, FedRAMP and others but also in turn transfer this capability out to our customers, which they then can use that, that their own end to meet with their respective compliance obligations. Some of the initiatives enabling our automation effort is a shared responsibility matrix called as Federal Operational Security Stack, which is purely an internal technology driven shared responsibility between our security org and our product teams where in the journey to a certification like FedRAMP becomes more faster and also efficient. Nice. What's one issue that keeps you up at night concerning the government's progress in implementing modern IT solutions? So our government is in this uh, cloud-first mindset where they're increasingly uh, interested in adopting modern IT technology. And as such, with any such technology adoption, one of the key core requirement that is needed is having the right security and technology talent pool. Um, so from a challenge wise, I would say that attracting the right security talent pool into our government um, infrastructure, into our government resources pool, and also having the right pace and the, uh, the, the, fa the acceleration mindset to adopt this new technology as well as enabling the vendors who provide this technology to meet with their respective attestations which are actually required to even provide these services back to the government. I think these are a couple of things, security, talent pool, um, having a fast paced mindset to adopt this technology, uh, which in turn enable them to move away from the old, uh, uh, I would say security prone infrastructure to a more, much more secure infrastructure that can be available to them. I think these are the main challenges that are in front of our government as they go through this IT modernization journey. Absolutely. Prashant, thank you so much for joining us today to talk about IT modernization. My pleasure. Thank you.